Hey guys, welcome to this video on compound interest formula. Uh, the A here is the amount after time t. The P is the initial amount at time zero. The interest rate is R. And for example, for that, if you ever have like a 5% interest rate, you would write that as 0 0.05. If it's a 4.5%, it'd be 0 0.045. So this is what you'd plug in for R. Uh, N is the compoundings per year. So something like quarterly, that would be four for N. Or monthly would be 12, or weekly would be 52. Uh, annually, it would be one. So that's how N works. And then T is the number of years. So just say three years. Uh, we will do some of these problems using this formula. So just write it down for now. Make sure you understand it. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. 